Yes, yeah, so uh, today uh, I want to finish the story about Ashkin Taylor. Uh, so, so what we found uh, the last time that if we want to consider the uh, uh, creator, the conformal block of uh, fields uh, of uh, dimensions uh, uh, 1 over 16 and uh, c, so it's uh, c equals 1, uh, dimensions of uh, this field uh, uh, is uh, 1 over 16, uh, and uh, uh, intermediate charges are conserved. So uh, this uh, sigma 0 of x, uh, sigma uh, 0 of, maybe better try it in this way, so OP of sigma zeros uh, uh, is uh, uh, the sum of uh, of uh, uh, bosonic uh, uh, exponentials. Uh, so if you want to compute a conformal block uh, uh, with uh, two j plus two sigma zeros uh, and uh, with fixed uh, uh, Intermediate alphas, something of this kind. One over sixteen. One over sixteen. And some. Uh, so, so this conformal block. Mm which we can denote as uh, some function b of, uh, oh, it was f probably, f0 of uh, uh, zi alpha i. So it, uh, it, turned out, it turned out that uh, this uh, conformal block um, equals to some a function which depends uh, uh, only on coordinates uh, times uh, exponential to some function which depends on uh, on uh, coordinates and uh, uh, internal momentum. And uh, this function uh, satisfies an equation uh, uh, d z i uh, of f uh, equals uh, to uh, one half of residue uh, d s squared over uh, d z uh, at z equals to z i and uh, this uh, d s squared is uh, uh, And the sum of uh, 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 canonically normalized uh, uh, homomorphic differentials. Uh, namely, um, oh, yes, of Z. So this ds of z, uh, uh, so, so uh, normalization of this differential is uh, like, uh, like this, uh, integral of uh, uh, 1 over 2 pi i, uh, integral over a cycle a i of uh, d omega j equals to delta i j. So, um, and uh, if we integrate uh, them over the B cycle, uh, it will give uh, a, a, an element of uh, so called period matrix of uh, the same surface. Uh, so, so uh, hmm. 
Okay. And keep uh, this uh, 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 space here, and uh, uh, and uh, uh, come back to the computation which I want to do on the last time. So, uh, namely, suppose that uh, we have uh, uh, two uh, uh, two uh, differentials, uh, homomorphic, meromorphic. It uh, does not matter. So there is some uh, d omega and d eta. And uh, uh, we take uh, uh, integral of uh, d eta from some point, uh, so uh, eta of uh, p equals to integral from p0 uh, to p of uh, d eta. Mm. And uh, uh, consider uh, this, uh, 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 consider the boundary of the Riemann surface. So uh, let us cut it uh, along uh, A cycles and B cycles and uh, and draw uh, its uh, uh, a boundary. So we have some A1 and we have uh, B1. Then we have uh, A1 inverse and then we have B1 inverse. And uh, uh, the same for any other cycle. Uh, let us uh, call uh, uh, this uh, this uh, uh, piece of uh, boundary uh, C1. And uh, try to compute uh, the integral of... Uh, so, uh, in principle, we want to... Uh, uh, to compute the integral over the boundary of uh, uh, of uh, our so it's sigma so, and its uh, its boundary, uh, in principle we want to integrate it uh, 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 over the uh, whole boundary. But let us consider just uh, this uh, part. Uh, so oh, we have noted that uh, uh, when we uh, 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 go back. Uh, if we go from this to point to uh, this one, then uh, uh, this function eta uh, becomes uh, the same, uh, and because it has a, a equal number of uh, uh, contributions from a cycle and b cycle, and we will be able to uh, do the same comp computation uh, for the next. Uh, um, a uh, quadruple of cycles uh, starting from this point. So uh, we really go back after this uh, 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 after this uh, 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 piece of boundary. So, so what we want to compute is uh, on the following integral. And it's integral over the boundary uh, and. Uh, so we remember that it also equals to 2 pi i uh, sum of residues. Mm. Okay. So uh, and on the other side, it can be written as a sum over uh, this uh, c i's uh, over i's. So let us compute the integral over C1. So uh, 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 first we can just write that, uh, okay, it is an uh, uh, integral over A1. Mm. Uh, eta d omega. But uh, then uh, when we go to uh, this uh, next uh, cycle, we know that uh, this point is the original point uh, shifted by a cycle. Uh, so uh, it means uh, that uh, 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 this uh, uh, function eta, due to this definition, is uh, shifted uh, by the uh, a by the a period of uh, 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 of uh, d eta, so uh, here we will have so 
uh, a initial value here is uh, shifted by uh, this constant. So here we have integral over b1 uh, of uh, eta plus uh, integral over a1 d eta times d omega. And then uh, uh, let us uh, uh, go to this point. Uh, here uh, it receives another contribution uh, from corresponding uh, uh, B cycle. So um, this will be the integral over uh, B, uh, over uh, so uh, here it will be integral uh, uh, over the um, A cycle but in the opposite direction. So it is integral over a1 of a function eta plus integral over a1 d eta plus integral over b2 d eta d omega. And uh, uh, the last uh, cycle is uh, this one. Uh, here uh, we uh, should uh, subtract uh, uh, the uh, uh, this a period because uh, we went uh, in the opposite direction along this a, a cycle. So the last contribution is uh, this one. Uh, we should remove uh, this uh, term. So it will be integral over b1 mm. eta plus integral over uh, mm. oh, sorry it's b1 b1 d eta d omega. And uh, uh, now let us look uh, at uh, this uh, formula. Uh, we have uh, 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 this integrals of uh, eta over uh, of eta d omega. Uh, so when I write eta, uh, I mean uh, uh, original eta, uh, which uh, uh, which was defined on this uh, uh, cycle uh, a, 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 a1. So, so here we have uh, this term, this term, this term, this term, and uh, uh, all the uh, 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 cancel. Mm. Maybe. Mm make some mistake
Uh, no, I, I made some mistake because uh, uh, Oh, no, maybe we cannot uh, treat uh, this uh, inverse uh, cycle in in this way. Um, it is uh, better to say that uh, uh, well, we, we computed the integral of this uh, function uh, along uh, this uh, uh, part of boundary. But uh, when we want to compute another uh, uh, piece, uh, we want to, uh, so that uh, all integrals are. Uh, along A and B cycles and not uh, um, their inverses. Uh, we can integrate the, in the opposite uh, direction starting from this point. Uh, so uh, uh, in this way, uh, we will get, so this integral will be integral over B1 uh, uh, of uh, just eta. Theta and the omega, and, uh, and the second integral will be uh, the integral. Uh, so, so it is uh, this integral, and uh, uh, this integral will be an integral of uh, or a one. Eta plus uh, its B period oh, maybe it's fine so, so now this these terms cancel and uh, we are left uh, so this is some constant uh, so we are left uh, with uh, uh, the integral over uh, a cycle of the eta The integral over the cycle of the the omega uh, minus uh, integral over the uh, cycle the eta integral over a cycle the omega. Okay. So. Uh, uh, are there any questions about this? So, so we know that it equals to two pi i uh, sum of uh, 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 residues uh, or points and uh, points in in uh, this uh, surface sigma, uh, eta and the omega. And it's called uh, Riemann bilinear uh, identity. So,
So uh, now uh, let us uh, try uh, to uh, use uh, uh, this uh, 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 formulas uh, uh, to this formula uh, to compute uh, the uh, uh, derivative of, uh, of a period matrix. Uh, and namely, uh, let us, uh, so, so uh, I already showed how to use it to prove that the uh, period matrix is symmetric, uh, but now let us uh, try to use it uh, for computation of uh, its derivative. Uh, uh, namely, uh, let us uh, say that uh, eta, uh, that uh, d eta is uh, uh, by default, uh, uh, by definition, uh, uh, a d z i of uh, of uh, of uh, a d omega j uh, d z mm, you should use some some other index mm, d z a there is some rent point and we, and we take this derivative. Uh, so uh, uh, d omega equals d omega i. Uh, so if you substitute it here, uh, then uh, uh, so the integral over a, a cycle of uh, d eta equals uh, to uh, to zero uh, because it is a derivative uh, of uh, uh, some uh, or any a cycle uh, of uh, some de delta chronica. Uh, so uh, the only remaining part is uh, 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 this one. So uh, uh, minus uh, uh, sorry, mm, I should have written here in the sum over all cycles. J A I B I B I A I. So uh, minus uh, dzi uh, of uh, uh, so uh, when we integrate uh, uh, omega over a, a cycle, uh, it gives uh, some uh, uh, element of uh, of period matrix. So. Uh, DZ minus dz a of tij equals to uh, sum of residues to pi i sum sum of residues of uh, 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 such object dz a omega j uh, times uh, d omega I. And, uh, omega j is uh, the integral of uh, in corresponding uh, homomorphic uh, one form. So eta is the uh, integral of uh, uh, d omega j. Uh, and uh, now let us look at the uh, residues of, uh, of this function. So uh, omega j uh, is uh, Uh, is uh, an uh, uh, integral uh, of uh, uh, so omega j uh, behaves as d omega j behaves like some constant over uh, a square root of uh, uh, z minus z b when z approaches zb. Uh, so uh, 
uh, integral of uh, uh, of the omega behaves like just square root. So omega j behaves like uh, square root of uh, z minus z b when z approaches z b. And the uh, uh, d omega, well, you know about the uh, d omega. Uh, uh, so uh, we see immediately that uh, 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 derivative of uh, omega j uh, around uh, uh, around uh, any uh, point different from uh, z a will be uh, regular. Well, less some constant, uh, and uh, this uh, uh, d omega uh, will behave like uh, one over square root. Uh, so, uh, so uh, in principle, so it can have a singularities uh, uh, at uh, in principle at uh, all these uh, zbs, uh, but uh, um, uh, it uh, does not uh, have a residue uh, when uh, this point is uh, uh, different from z. So is, is it clear? Because uh, so when uh, b is different from a, hmm, the omega j uh, behaves like so. Okay, I should write dz uh, dz over square root of z minus z b. Omega uh, i, maybe better to write here i. Omega i uh, uh, is a, a constant, uh, so uh, it cannot have a, a singularity uh, around this point. But uh, uh, let us look at point b equals to a. Uh, the omega i uh, uh, equals uh, to uh, 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 some, let us write f of uh, z, or maybe phi of z, the z over square root of uh, uh, z minus z b. So, mm, uh, the most uh, uh, singular part, uh, uh, so uh, let us now differentiate it. Mm. It will be uh, phi prime of uh, uh, z dz over square root of uh, z minus z b. Mm. Uh, plus uh, one half phi of z dz minus zb to three halves. Uh, so and uh, uh, now if we uh, in, uh, if we integrate uh, this uh, and we say that uh, uh, omega i uh, behaves uh, like uh, uh, so again in, in integrate uh, this expression uh, in z. And it will behave like minus one half uh, phi of z over square root of uh, z minus z b plus a constant. Uh, so uh, we, uh, if you look uh, at this expression, and at uh, this expression, uh, oh, sorry, it is uh, d z a. Uh, uh, well, 
and it is the A. So and here without my without one half. So if we compare these two expressions, uh, we see that uh, uh, around uh, the singularity uh, there is an identity that uh, omega i equals to d omega i uh, d z a of omega i equals to d omega to minus uh, d omega i over dz. Plus uh, something regular. Uh, we can write uh, that it is a uh, um, oh, plus constant. Not plus plus, plus all one. So it is a derivative, and uh, this is just uh, the uh, ratio of two differential forms. Uh, and it happens when z is around the a. Uh, so uh, therefore, uh, uh, we can say uh, we can substitute it into this uh, relation. And say that uh, d z a of uh, t i j was to two pi i So, oh, maybe, maybe I, mm, I, I missed some, uh, some two pi i's because uh, in the left hand side we had uh, a cycle of uh, um, this uh, omegas which equal to two pi uh, to two pi i. So. Uh, it should not be in the answer. So, so and uh, now if we uh, uh, look at uh, uh, this uh, uh, relation, mm. uh, we can conclude that. Uh, uh, That uh, this f a equals uh, to uh, one half of uh, uh, sum of uh, a i a j t i j. And uh, if we now differentiate it in the uh, a d a i f uh, it will give a uh, uh, sum of uh, uh, a i uh, sum of a j t i j Uh, which is uh, in integral over uh, a, a cycle corresponding a i of uh, uh, ds. And uh, uh, we can recognize here uh, the Bergwitten equation.
right? So So the uh, uh, end of this story. Uh, uh, do you have any question, uh, questions about this? Yeah. Oh. Uh, ah, thank you, yes. And by the way, uh, this uh, identity is uh, uh, often uh, uh, very useful because, uh, 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 for example, uh, if we uh, choose uh, eta to be, uh, if we choose d eta to be a homomorphic uh, differential, and and uh, uh, d omega. Uh, uh, to be a, a sort kind of differential with uh, uh, some uh, uh, poles uh, at some points, we can uh, uh, see that uh, uh, in the left hand side uh, we have some periods of this uh, differential of uh, sort kind, and uh, in the right hand side uh, uh, we get uh, 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 what is called an uh, 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 map of uh, uh, of uh, its uh, zeros. Okay. A integral uh, of uh, homomorphic differentials uh, and not uh, along a and b cycles but uh, from uh, uh, but in between uh, different points and uh, So uh, let me uh, tell uh, uh, the generalization of this uh, story, uh, namely, uh, Uh, so uh, uh, first of all, uh, let us uh, uh, try uh, to bosonize uh, this picture. So uh, we can say that uh, again uh, we have uh, this uh, Riemann surface, um, uh, this double cover. How to how to draw it like this? Mm. Uh, so uh, we can say that this I of G uh, equals, uh, uh, or maybe better to say that uh, we have uh, some uh, J of Z above. Uh, and it equals to uh, uh, Psi star of Z, uh, Psi of Z. And uh, uh, we uh, um, go uh, to the um, uh, 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 to, uh, to the cover and uh, find uh, that uh, and now we have uh, uh, psi one and psi two corresponding to different uh, sheets of uh, this cover. And uh, this uh, J of Z, uh, so, so we have uh, two J of Z. Uh, which is uh, uh, Psi 1 star Psi 1. Uh, or maybe we can say that uh, this I of Z 
uh, is a uh, one half of psi one star psi one minus psi two star psi two, uh, and uh, uh, there is some j diagonal. Uh, so uh, uh, this analytic continuation around zero uh, permutes uh, psi one and uh, psi one star, psi two and, uh, and psi uh, two star. Uh, so this uh, uh, current changes uh, sign. Uh, this uh, and uh, nothing happens to this one. Uh, so, but, uh, so we can say that. Uh, 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 psi one star, psi two star, uh, and go to some matrix. Uh, uh, in this case, it is permutation matrix. Psi one star, psi two star, uh, and uh, uh, psi one, psi two. Uh, go to the. Uh, in the same matrix, uh, well, in this case, uh, they are the same. Inverse transposed, maybe. No, but. So, uh, a generalization uh, of this story is uh, uh, the following. Uh, uh, so, in this uh, fermionic uh, in this fermionic formalism, uh, we have permutation matrix, and uh, uh, it was only our uh, luck uh, that uh, this uh, uh, anti-diagonal current uh, just changes uh, sign and uh, does not turn into uh, into some arbitrary combination. So, in the uh, general case, uh, we don't have it, uh, we have only fermions. And, uh, uh, and uh, this twist uh, can be given by arbitrary matrix. So, namely, uh, psi 1 star, uh, psi 2 star, uh, uh, I can go to some matrix uh, C. And uh, uh, since uh, they should satisfy anti-commutation relations, uh, anti-commutation relations with uh, psi one and psi two, uh, this uh, uh, psi one and psi two uh, transform by, if I remember correctly, inverse transposed. Uh, so. Uh, the main important uh, observation is that uh, if we uh, perform this transformation, then uh, corresponding Verasora uh, uh, algebra. Well, maybe uh, let me write uh, that uh, there are even more fermions, more than two. So, uh, so if you consider the generators uh, of the W algebra, mm. Uh, they are a uh, twist invariant. Uh, 
and uh, since uh, they are twist invariant, it means that uh, when we go around this uh, point, uh, uh, they as uh, functions of uh, z are single valued, and it means that uh, they can be expanded uh, into uh, the integer modes. So, in this case, you can bear it and as a uh, uh, sum of uh, UKN over Z to K plus N. So it is a normal mode expansion. Uh, and uh, uh, moreover, uh, so we actually did this uh, computation at some moment, uh, but it was uh, for the diagonal twist. But uh, you see that uh, here everything is a uh, JLN invariant, uh, and uh, um, because of this invariance, we can uh, we can say that uh, uh, this uh, uh, twist field uh, uh, is uh, invariant uh, uh, under uh, so, uh, oh, sorry. Oh, I want no. Uh, and this twist field is uh, uh, a primary field uh, for the W algebra. W and plus Heisinger. It follows uh, just uh, from a, 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 from uh, that uh, computation of uh, uh, of a regular product uh, in terms of uh, usual uh, fermionic normal ordering uh, in presence of a trivial twist. So we can uh, 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 do it for diagonalized matrix. And, so, uh, the eigenvalue of this uh, twist field are given by the uh, eigenvalues of uh, 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 of a uh, logarithm of this uh, matrix uh, C. Uh, so so um, the charges of uh, uh, we can say so if uh, C is uh, proportional e to the two pi i sigma one e to the two pi i Sigma n, and this uh, 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 sigmas uh, are W charts. In the sense uh, that eigenvalues of this uh, uh, of uh, zero mode of the generators are uh, uh, symmetric uh, functions of uh, sigmas. Mm. So. Uh, Uh, I can add this. So,
Uh, 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 let us now uh, look uh, at the uh, uh, curvature, uh, which contains uh, several twist fields and uh, uh, also contains uh, a pair of permanents. So uh, uh, let us uh, uh, X and Y. So, uh, Psi star alpha and uh, psi beta. So, uh, what uh, uh, do uh, we know about this curvature? Uh, we know that uh, uh, it has uh, uh, this monodromy properties uh, with some matrices uh, uh, M. Uh, and uh, uh, MIs, uh, when we go around each of uh, these points, uh, uh, corresponding to the twist fields. Uh, and uh, uh, I also know that it has a first order similarity at the diagonal. Uh, so, um, uh, if you want uh, to write a function uh, with this property, it can be done uh, uh, this way. So, um, you can write some y of uh, x, uh, y of w. Alpha beta over x minus w where this where of x is a function uh, which has a monogram is a mi around uh, all these uh, singular points. So this monogram is actually from the left. Uh, we can write that omega x uh, shifted by uh, contra gamma corresponding to uh, i uh, uh, shifted by contra gamma i corresponding to i's a point. Uh, this y should be multiplied by m i. So. So is it clear that uh, uh, on the left hand side and the right hand side uh, have uh, on the same uh, analytic properties? Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, uh, 
uh, uh, let me uh, uh, remind uh, uh, what I was uh, uh, telling about uh, such functions uh, uh, some time ago. So uh, if uh, this function has this asymptotics, uh, uh, if it has this modem, is, uh, then we can write that uh, uh, a y of x uh, that uh, y of uh, x uh, when x goes to the i can be written as uh, some uh, c i e to the 2 pi i theta i uh, oh no z minus z i z minus z i x minus z i to some it's a diagonal matrix times uh, some function of uh, gi of z. Uh, gi of x. And, uh, 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 and now we can uh, uh, differentiate uh, this function in uh, two ways. Uh, 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 one way is uh, to differentiate it in x, and, uh, and then we get that uh, uh, d over dx uh, or fx. So this differentiation is, uh, of course, performed uh, with uh, fixed modernness. It will be given by some uh, uh, by multiplication by some uh, matrix uh, uh, A, A, A i over A x minus the i, and uh, uh, on this matrix. Uh, uh, pairs uh, from conjugation. So, so uh, the most uh, singular term uh, comes uh, from a uh, differentiation of uh, 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 this uh, power. Uh, so, um, this AI, and then uh, given by um, GI of ZI uh, inverse uh, theta I j of z i right and uh, and uh, in the same way uh, we can uh, uh, differentiate it uh, in uh, z i and uh, so d over z i with fixed monogramms So, uh, what uh, would you say uh, uh, is the uh, result uh, here? Given the no, no, they, they all uh, depend. Uh, this one also depends on the eyes. Uh, but uh, uh, let us say that uh, um, we fix something at infinity. Uh, Maybe uh, we can say that uh, y of x is 1 at infinity. Mm. And, uh, uh, and uh, then uh, we can uh, get rid of uh, any constants. Mm. So let us say that y of uh, infinity equals to 1. And we can choose uh, such a normalization. It's an invariant and uh, uh, all possible conjugations and so on. So let us choose it. So uh, 
Hmm? Mm -hmm. uh, oh, sorry. I, here I, I forgot uh, to write uh, some of uh, eyes uh, because uh, 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 because uh, it uh, can have singularity at any of these points. Uh, any of them uh, depend, uh, depends on x. Uh, here uh, uh, there is contribution only from a single point. And the way this computation somehow reminds uh, that one, maybe it's because of all such computations are similar. Uh, so here it is uh, AI over minus AI over X minus Y. Uh, times minus Y of X. Uh, so uh, we see that uh, uh, there are these uh, uh, two equations uh, uh, and uh, uh, in principle we can write uh, their compatibility condition. Uh, It's a little bit inconvenient uh, when a matrix is act uh, from the right, uh, but uh, uh, let us uh, just try that. Uh, this compatibility condition is uh, uh, d over dx uh, acting on the left. Uh, uh, Minus a of z uh, d over the uh, zi plus uh, a i over x minus zi. I, I don't want to do this computation now, uh, but uh, uh, the uh, a general statement is uh, that uh, so if you do this uh, correctly, then the statement is that uh, this matrix is uh, a uh, satisfy uh, so-called uh, Schlesinger system. Dii over d z j equals to um, Maybe in this case, a uh, minus commutator of uh, AI AJ over ZI minus ZJ. And the uh, sum of all AIs is zero. Hmm? Yes, so if you uh, uh, compute, uh, if you first compute uh, x derivative of y, then uh, z derivative of y, or vice versa, uh, it, will, uh, it will be the same. So uh, we can add it like this. So we put here y, these derivatives act uh, on y and matrices also act uh, to, uh, to the left. So uh, we do this computation carefully and uh, probably get uh, this uh, 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 system.
example, Uh, we, we can check that uh, the system is uh, actually uh, Hamiltonian. So, Uh, and uh, uh, Poisson bracket uh, uh, is uh, this one. Uh, so it uh, uses a structure constant of uh, GLN. So it is a uh, delta IJ. Uh, Uh, maybe it was a uh, minus sign. I don't remember precisely, but uh, it should be delta um, beta gamma a alpha delta minus delta uh, alpha delta a gamma beta. And the uh, uh, Hamiltonians uh, corresponding to and this uh, uh, evolution in uh, uh, the eyes uh, can be written uh, like this. So uh, we can write uh, this uh, equations of motion like uh, uh, dA uh, i over d z j uh, equals to a Poisson packet of uh, Some Hamiltonian HJ uh, with uh, AI. And this uh, Hamiltonian HJ uh, is uh, one half uh, a trace of uh, a residue uh, mm, Residue of trace uh, of this squared dz. Uh, H and So it can be obtained uh, by uh, explicit computation. It's not so hard to see. Mm. So, but uh, these Hamiltonians are uh, time dependent because uh, this, uh, these are times and uh, they uh, enter these Hamiltonians explicitly. So we can write uh, some explicit formula like Hj equals to sum over k different from j uh, trace of uh, Ai Aj of a j k over z j minus uh, z k. So we can we can check that it, it actually works. Well, it is a, 
kind of clear that uh, some formula of this kind uh, can work because uh, uh, here we have quadratic uh, 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 right hand side and uh, here we need to, uh, to compute uh, uh, for some bracket between uh, something linear and something quadratic. So it, uh, it will be some quadratic expression and we can check that precisely on this one. So, but uh, uh, now uh, yeah, let us uh, try uh, to use uh, this fact uh, that it is uh, uh, Hamiltonian and uh, 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 we can also uh, uh, look at uh, explicit formulas for those Hamiltonians. So, Hmm? Uh, this one, a system, uh, uh, such system that it's equation of motion, equa equations of motion uh, given by, you know, by uh, uh, Hamilton equations. Mm -hmm. So it's, uh, uh, I don't know, uh, 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 if people call this uh, multi-Hamiltonian or not, but uh, you see that uh, there are Hamiltonians uh, corresponding to each of uh, these flows. And, So uh, uh, let us uh, now uh, try to think about uh, uh, compatibility of uh, such uh, uh, of such a uh, system. Uh, uh, namely, uh, we want to uh, compute. Uh, uh, so. Uh, we want to compute uh, the uh, mixed derivative of some function. Mm. So, uh, in principle, uh, In principle, uh, uh, there are functions uh, that uh, depend uh, not only uh, on uh, uh, these as uh, on uh, times, uh, so uh, dependence of uh, dynamical variables. There are also functions uh, that uh, depend on uh, depend on uh, the, uh, on these uh, uh, explicitly. And uh, a, a, if we want to differentiate uh, such function in uh, ZI, we need to introduce a kind of uh, a, a total partial derivatives. Uh, we need to say that uh, there are derivatives D over ZI, which involve uh, both uh, uh, time dependence of dynamical variables and explicit uh, dependence on uh, Z. And uh, uh, they do the following. D over ZI, F uh, uh, equals uh, to uh, D uh, F over, well, maybe I should have written it uh, here so that uh, we don't miss uh, uh, explicit uh, partial derivatives in the eyes uh, with uh, uh, this uh, total derivatives. Mm. So it is explicit uh, uh, and uh, uh, all other dependence uh, 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 comes from uh, Hamiltonian dynamics. So it is given by the Poisson bracket.
Oh, 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 yes. uh, uh, so, mm, uh, uh, we know that uh, if, so uh, this f is uh, uh, just uh, some function of uh, all these uh, zi's, and if you uh, 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 try to differentiate it uh, in uh, 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 different orders, uh, uh, and then we see that uh, it will be just uh, a different mixed derivatives, so they should uh, coincide. So uh, it means that uh, a commutator of uh, d over dzi commutes uh, with d over dzj on the space of functions. And so if you write uh, this explicitly, uh, it uh, gives us uh, what it is a commutator of uh, d over dzi plus uh, plus uh, this uh, uh, operator of course on bracket was uh, I I Hamiltonian So, so this sh should be zero. Uh, so it, it contains a trivial term commutator of derivatives, and uh, for one term uh, we need to uh, do some sh uh, uh, short computation. Uh, Namely, uh, what happens when we uh, compute uh, the commutator of uh, DORDZ uh, with a uh, uh, Poisson bracket? What is act with it uh, on some function? So uh, it is uh, DORDZ. It was F. Minus uh, H with uh, D F over D Z. We say that this term cancels, and uh, the only remaining term is uh, D H over D Z with F. So uh, a kind of expected answer. So uh, so it's like a bracket of dh of rdz, bracket of on bracket acting on f. So uh, if we apply it here, uh, we ah, and the uh, 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 commutator of uh, of uh, this uh, person bracket operators. Uh, uh, equals to a Poisson bracket of, uh, uh, of Poisson bracket uh, uh, because of uh, uh, Jacobi identity. So, so it gives uh, HIJ a plus. Uh, and dh uh, j over d z i minus d h i over d d z j uh, so um, so compat compatibility uh, then uh, tells us uh, that uh, 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 a sum of uh, h i j plus d h j over d z i plus uh, 
minus uh, dih i over dj. But uh, if you look uh, at the uh, explicit formula uh, for this uh, Hamiltonians, uh, we can see that uh, i's derivative of uh, uh, hj gives uh, uh, precisely one term containing these two, uh, two matrices, a i and a j, divided by a corresponding uh, ratio of z minus uh, a, a, um, ratio of z to, uh, to the second power. And it is uh, symmetric. Uh, so uh, we see that uh, uh, this, uh, this uh, expression vanishes uh, separately. Uh, this mixed derivatives of uh, of uh, Hamiltonians uh, uh, vanish, and uh, since it is zero, the Poisson bracket of this Hamiltonians uh, also vanishes. So it is a, a kind of a classical uh, compatibility, a classical uh, integrability of the system, and uh, this is a. Uh, uh, something uh, specific for isomorphic uh, deformations. Mm. And together, they give this compatibility condition for the isomorphic system. But uh, if we uh, see this, uh, then Functionally independent. In the sense that, uh, mm. yeah, mm. every Hamiltonian is designed independent because of function. No. Uh, uh, first of all, uh, if we define it uh, uh, this way, especially if we uh, don't, uh, uh, if we don't. Uh, uh, put anything at a infinity, those Hamiltonians uh, satisfy uh, identities which uh, uh, might look uh, quite familiar. Uh, namely, let us uh, see what happens when z goes to infinity. f of z uh, behaves uh, uh, like uh, uh, 1 over uh, z uh, uh, squared. Now, no infinity. Uh, so, uh, if we uh, take uh, uh, so if we take a uh, trace of residue oh, one half of uh, residue of uh, z to k trace. Uh, of the squared uh, dz uh, z equals to infinity and k equals uh, k equals uh, 0, 1 and 2 so, uh, so what does this uh, 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 z equals to infinity. What does this residue equal to? Hmm? For the specific values of k. Yes. Uh, so this from one side. Uh, from the other side, it equals to uh, well. Uh, here we can uh, uh, write it with opposite sign. Uh, so uh, sum of residues uh, one half sum of re uh, residues uh, 
Z equals to Z K uh, or Z I uh, Z K uh, trace of Z squared Z and uh, let me remind that uh, uh, trace uh, uh, um, or, or define it uh, ai squared one half of trace ai squared of s a squared equals to delta i but then just uh, denote it on this way and uh, so it is a uh, one definition another definition is uh, that uh, a residue of uh, this expression uh, uh, coefficient in front of uh, first order pole is uh, given by the Hamiltonian. So, uh, uh, can you uh, 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 can you compute uh, this uh, uh, sum of residues? Or, so it, it is sum, sum or i's. Can you compute such residue? So uh, we just take derivative, so it will be somewhere from sum of uh, k is the k minus one uh, delta i uh, the i plus. Uh, Z I K H I so so we see that uh, there are three uh, and there are three relations between these Hamiltonians uh, uh, so uh, uh, for example, for uh, uh, just uh, on three single uh, points, uh, this problem becomes uh, trivial. Mm. And uh, the reason is that uh, if you have only uh, three uh, 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 single points, uh, then monogram matrices uh, uh, can be recovered uh, uniquely from uh, their uh, eigenvalues. And, and so uh, the linear system is also defined, the, the matrices of the linear system are also defined uniquely uh, up to some conjugation. And so there is no dynamics. And first non trivial case is when n equals to 4. And uh, when, I don't know, does it look like, uh, <laughs> like some answer? Uh, oh, yeah, you asked about uh, functional independence of this uh, uh, H's, uh, and uh, I am saying that uh, no, they are not independent. And uh, 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 the meaning uh, uh, of uh, uh, this uh, so uh, uh, is uh, to say it. So in this. Uh, Mm, as, as, as three uh, vector uh, this uh, uh, three constraints uh, correspond uh, to either uh, three uh, vector fields uh, on a sphere like dz, uh, z dz, and the z squared dz, or another one which uh, it corresponds uh, to global uh, world identities, which corresponds to L minus one. L0 and uh, L1. Mm. 
Yeah, but I, I was uh, telling about uh, uh, this uh, compatibility conditions because uh, I want uh, uh, to uh, look at uh, mixed uh, derivatives of uh, these Hamiltonians. So, uh, yeah, let us uh, uh, compute uh, the uh, let us compute uh, uh, dh a over dz j. It contains uh, two parts. One is uh, dh i. Mm. over dzj another one is a uh, uh, person bracket hj was hi but uh, since uh, we know that uh, mixed uh, uh, partial derivatives equal to zero person bracket equal to zero so we see that uh, this uh, uh, whole partial derivative h a over uh, dzj equals to dh uh, j over dzi. Uh, so we can say that locally the Hamiltonians are uh, derivatives of, uh, uh, of uh, some uh, function uh, uh, which is called a uh, local orbital function. h i equals to d over dzi. Uh, so, uh, uh, this uh, constraint uh, uh, on uh, the Hamiltonians uh, can be written this way. Can be written as a constraint uh, on the tau function itself. Mm. So, uh, sum from i equals 1 to n. Uh, let, let me write it as a, uh, as a, a set of uh, uh, equations for uh, a different case. So sum from 1 to n uh, dzi tau equals to 0 sum from 1 to n delta i plus delta i plus z i d z i return on tau equals to zero and Does it uh, look familiar? Hmm? Uh, 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 yes, yeah, so these are from over the identities. So it behaves really, uh, so in this sense, it's, uh, it behaves really like a, a, a correlator of uh, primary fields of, of well, correlator of some fields with dimensions uh, delta i. For example, the style function for three points can be computed explicitly. So, in the same computation as in a CFD. Mm. Uh, but it's not the only object which looks uh, similar to something in CFD. There is uh, uh, even a uh, uh, a more interesting expression, uh, and uh, this expression and this uh, uh, one half of trace, uh, one half of uh, trace of uh, of this squared. So we can write it uh, 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 as a sum of uh, residues, and. Uh, uh, 
Okay. It looks like this. So, um, let us write it as one over tau. Sum from So what what does it uh, uh, remind you? Yes, exactly. So uh, uh, we can write uh, that. Uh, Uh, because uh, here we have logarithmic derivative of tau. Yes, uh, logarithmic derivative. Ah. Chi is by definition logarithmic derivative of, of tau. Mm. Mm. Uh, so, uh, 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 mm, mm, this object. Uh, uh, mm, mm. The subject uh, looks uh, very much uh, like uh, the uh, uh, ratio of energy momentum tensor uh, in uh, some CFT divided by, uh, by the square itself. Uh, but uh, it is uh, uh, not uh, 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 very clear at this moment. So it was uh, uh, not clear uh, at the beginning what kind of safety should be here. And uh, uh, as they told uh, Munner and the Elisavit, they first uh, computed uh, the second term of conformal block uh, to see uh, the value of the central charge and found that it is one. And basically, they uh, found, they uh, looked at the first uh, uh, term of expansion of the present function and uh, realized uh, that uh, they are very similar to conformal blocks. And then uh, uh, found that it is the uh, C equals 1 conformal block. Mm. But uh, 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 there should be some explanation to uh, this fact, uh, like uh, uh, not an explanation, but explanation why it corresponds uh, uh, precisely to this, to this uh, theory. So uh, to establish this relation, uh, we should uh, 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 compute uh, a correlator of uh, the energy momentum tensor, which can be obtained uh, here. Uh, and uh, compare it uh, with uh, the uh, uh, CFT uh, uh, with uh, uh, the isomodromic formula. Mm -hmm. And if we uh, see that uh, they coincide, uh, then it means uh, that uh, 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 this uh, correlator is actually the isomodromic tau function. So it is a, it is a similar logic uh, to what uh, we uh, have done uh, for uh, Ashton Taylor, and it uh, happens uh, uh, so uh, uh, quite often that uh, to find that uh, some object uh, 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 that some objects coincide uh, is easier. Uh, to uh, compute uh, the uh, logarithmic derivative by inserting some uh, energy momentum tensor, uh, basically. Uh, and, uh, mm, uh, uh, and to prove that it's uh, the same. So, mm. so we need uh, uh, 
So if we find uh, that uh, mm, if we find uh, that uh, energy momentum tensor of uh, this uh, theory is uh, actually a trace of uh, this squared, uh, then uh, we obtain uh, immediately that uh, this correlator uh, without uh, uh, fermions uh, is uh, as a monotonic metal function because. Uh, and then they will give me derivative. Uh, uh, we can write that the uh, CFT expression is uh, uh, like uh, one over the scalator, uh, sum of uh, delta i's times scalator. So, mm. but uh, we have everything uh, to do this computation because uh, uh, we have explicit formula uh, for this correlator of two fermions, and this formula is uh, in terms of uh, uh, isomorphic objects. So, mm. so it remains only uh, to construct uh, the energy momentum tensor on the left hand side. So, Uh, uh, so uh, we know that uh, if we uh, uh, take uh, mm, uh, a such kind of uh, expression, uh, It uh, will be uh, one over t uh, n over t plus uh, plus uh, j of x uh, plus uh, I think uh, uh, just uh, uh, t times n energy momentum tensor plus and so on because uh, when we uh, uh, when we uh, 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 take uh, the first uh, term of expansion uh, uh, in a t it gives one half of derivative of this fermion plus uh, the same term minus mm, the same term is the derivative of this fermion. And we computed at the moment that it is uh, the energy momentum tensor uh, for uh, the complex fermions. Mm. Uh, so mm, uh, if we want to uh, to uh, uh, to uh, get uh, uh, the expectation of the energy momentum tensor, uh, then uh, uh, we can take a trace of that expression, uh, and uh, and uh, expand uh, when uh, x when uh, one variable is x plus t over two, another variable is x minus t over two. So. Uh, uh, we can say that n over 2, uh, n over t, plus uh, j of x, uh, plus 
the g of x uh, plus and so on, and sort it under the correlator. Uh, oh, sorry. I do. I forgot to, to divide uh, this left hand side by uh, by the correlate um, by the uh, correlate of uh, these fields uh, themselves. We need to normalize it in this way. Mm. So. We divide it by the correlator of O1, ON, and it equals to uh, to trace of uh, Y of uh, X plus T over 2, Y inverse of uh, X minus T over 2. divided by t. So we need to expand uh, the numerator up to a uh, third order. Uh, so how uh, to do this? Uh, we know uh, 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 we know uh, 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 that uh, uh, y solves uh, this linear system. So, uh, y of x plus uh, so We can normalize it uh, uh, such that it equals to uh, 1 at, uh, uh, at uh, delta x equals to 0 plus uh, some c1 delta x plus c2 delta x squared. Mm. And uh, our matrix A. is equal to a of x plus uh, delta x uh, da of x. And uh, it's uh, enough uh, to find uh, all the uh, to find uh, this uh, coefficients of expansion of uh, uh, y. So uh, if we uh, say that uh, uh, dy equals to a y uh, to y a, it tells us that uh, c1 plus uh, uh, 2 c2 delta x uh, equals to a of x plus uh, um, c1 um, oh, um, plus uh, C1 of x plus uh, x plus uh, 
dot x uh, di so if you look at this uh, at this uh, equation well plus higher orders but uh, we don't care so if you look here we find that uh, while uh, x plus dot x equals to uh, 1 plus uh, fx dot x Uh, plus, uh, okay, it is uh, f x squared. It's mm. one half. So it's one expansion. Uh, if you now uh, try to uh, uh, compute uh, inverse uh, uh, function, then uh, what sh 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 should we get? Maybe we can compute uh, x minus delta x from the beginning. So we use uh, Taylor series. It is uh, 1 minus uh, 1 half fx uh, plus da plus, plus da delta x squared. Mm. Uh, plus uh, uh, fx squared. So, so it is a similar expression. Oh, sorry. 1 plus side of x delta x. So mm, we have such mm, a expression, such expression, and we need to multiply them. So and substitute delta x equals to t over two. So uh, let us do it one by one. Mm. Uh, uh, we get uh, so we, here we get uh, the storm from uh, 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 two. Uh, a of x is uh, 1 plus 2 a of x dot x plus uh, plus, uh, plus uh, Two f x squared dot x squared, and the other term was a derivative of a cancels. So if you now substitute a dot x equals to t over two, uh, we get uh, that it is a uh, n n over t plus uh, mm, t trace uh, a of x. Plus, uh, I, oh, plus, trace of 
AFX plus T over 2 trace uh, AFX squared. So when we look at the uh, left hand side, the right hand side, and uh, see that uh, uh, this uh, diagonal part corresponds to expectation value of uh, uh, U1 uh, 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 boson uh, and uh, mm, and uh, um, this uh, term corresponds to an agile momentum tensor, and uh, uh, we get precisely uh, this uh, formula, which we expected uh, as from uh, 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 general observations. So uh, uh, the point is that uh, if uh, 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 we uh, take uh, such twist fields which are uh, uh, analogs of, uh, of uh, Ashkenthal R1, uh, but uh, uh, for a uh, uh, general monogram is uh, uh, then a corresponding uh, correlator in uh, a CFT uh, will equal to the isomotromic tau function, which existed uh, uh, along uh, uh, before, uh, ah, no, actually, the tau function itself was in invented by uh, Sata Jimba and Miva, and it was uh, maybe 10 years before the invention of CFT. And uh, as a matter of deformations, uh, exist uh, uh, from, uh, 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 from the uh, uh, beginning of the 20th century, so, or from before the CFT. Mm. And also, uh, and there is uh, one nice uh, thing uh, about uh, the relation of the story to that uh, Ashkin Taylor conformal block. Because uh, uh, you see that uh, um, uh, 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 that situation uh, corresponds uh, to some uh, particular isomodromic uh, problem with uh, some. Uh, uh, have some special value of monodromous. Uh, this monodromous is uh, become a permutation matrices. And, uh, uh, but, uh, in, in, on the CFT side, uh, we know uh, uh, the formula for conformal book. And it is uh, super simple. It's a quadratic exponential of uh, this uh, U1 charges. Mm. And uh, it turns out that if you um, uh, try to compute uh, as an atomic tau function, which uh, comes uh, from that conformal block, we will just uh, need to perform a, a discrete uh, summation and discrete Fourier transformation in this uh, intermediate uh, you uh, want charges because of uh, this relation between uh, bosons and uh, fermions, uh, uh, because the uh, fermionic uh, uh, module is a uh, direct sum of bosonic uh, module with uh, shifted dimensions. So if you perform this uh, uh, Fourier transformation, uh, uh, we see that the uh, 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 tau function is just a theta function. Uh, with uh, um, a period matrix uh, given uh, by uh, the period matrix of this uh, hyper uh, elliptic curve. And uh, uh, it's funny that uh, it is a little bit easier to obtain uh, this formula for uh, as an atomic uh, science uh, uh, starting from CFT. But it is also known uh, uh, for uh, uh, specialists in uh, as a wonder, uh, for panel six it is uh, called uh, Picard solution. Uh, okay. okay, maybe that's all. Uh, do you have any questions about this? Okay, so thanks for your attention, thanks for attending the course.